What's going on swim fans? In this video, I'm gonna share with you how to swim breaststroke. We're gonna break down the stroke step by step. We're gonna talk about body position, how you pull, how you kick, what your head should be doing, when you should be breathing. We're gonna break down the stroke into all the incremental steps so that you can swim faster and smarter than ever before. So whether you're learning the stroke for the first time or you're trying to take your breaststroke to the next level and improve the individual medley and do all of the strokes proficiently, you've come to the right place. So make sure you watch the video until the very end and let me know what questions you have down below in the comments. If you guys are new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel and like this video and let's begin. We're swimming breaststroke. Now breaststroke is one of my favorite strokes for a few reasons, we'll get into that. The first thing I wanna talk about is the timing of the stroke. This is often the most confusing part of breaststroke. And I want you to think in your head, when you swim breaststroke, pull, kick, glide. And when you swim the stroke, you should actually think about that. Pull, kick, glide. Let's talk about each of those three parts. The first part is the pull. You wanna make sure when you're pulling breaststroke that your arms are symmetrical, like butterfly. And as you leave the streamlined position to initiate your first stroke, you're actually gonna sweep out just past your shoulders. So imagine I'm doing this with both of my arms. I'm sweeping out just past my shoulders and then you're gonna sweep in and you're gonna start to pull with a high elbow catch until your nose. So you're gonna pull the water to your shoulders and then you're gonna sweep in to your nose and then your hands are gonna join together and you're gonna return back to streamline. So that's the pull. We'll make sure we have good B-roll to show you guys that. Now let's talk about the next phase. Remember, pull, kick, glide. How do we do the kick? It's also symmetrical. You wanna have your feet flex, and you wanna to think to yourself, up, out, around, and together. That's how you swim the breaststroke kick. Up, out, around, together, and then you wanna really squeeze at the end and make sure your feet touch each other to finish the stroke. Now remember, in the phases, pull, kick, glide. So we have to have a gliding phase, and that gliding phase happens in streamline. Remember, streamline is the most fundamental body position in swimming. It's the fastest. All of your speed and breaststroke happens in streamline. So after you finish the kick, make sure you focus on maintaining that streamline for as long as you can. Ideally count to two seconds. So pull, kick, glide, and count to two. Pull, kick, glide. And the breath happens with the pull. Let's give it a try. Breaststroke can be one of the most enjoyable and natural strokes to swim for some. For others, it's quite the opposite and breaststroke feels painfully slow. Recall that breaststroke and butterfly are both short axis strokes. Rather than rotating around a center axis that extends from the head through the spine, in butterfly and breaststroke, you pivot your upper body using your hips as a horizontal axis point. Simply put, this upper body pivot in short axis strokes and the fact that your body position is lower in the water is why breaststroke is the slowest stroke. There is no reason to be afraid or avoid breaststroke. If anything, this means there's even greater opportunity to advance your skill and swim faster because there is so much opportunity to improve. Since we know that when we swim breaststroke, we're lower in the water, we must first address our body position. During the breath, your hips will naturally sink to the lowest position of the stroke, causing a massive amount of water resistance, and therefore slowing you down. The more efficiently you can keep your hips high in the water, the less you'll slow down and the faster you'll swim. Remember, streamline is the fundamental body position in swimming. In breaststroke, every stroke starts and ends in this position. Remember that your goal in breaststroke is to keep your body position as high as possible during all the phases of the stroke. When we put it all together, there is a lot that you can improve with breaststroke. From mastering the timing, the pull, the kick, and the streamline, there's simply a lot of opportunity to improve regardless of how fast or proficient you already are. Beyond just mastering the stroke mechanics, there is a massive potential to swim faster just by being smarter with your training. Now before I share how you can train and swim breaststroke faster than ever before, I've got to tell you about today's video sponsor, Geology. Geology creates personalized skincare regimens for men. 
Whether you're new to skincare or you're a seasoned pro, Geology has something for you. Now their products help reduce dark circles and puffy eyes, they fight acne, and they even reduce the fine lines and wrinkles, and they keep your skin moisturized between swims. Now I've been using the Essential Acne Kit for a few months now, and it's absolutely amazing. It's a really easy two-step process, and you've gotta try this out. I start out with the Everyday Face Watch, which I absolutely love. This thing is amazing. And then I finish off with the Repairing Night Cream to keep my pores clear and skin moisturized. Now I haven't always been the best at taking care of my skin, it's something I always just kicked down the road and said I'll worry about this later, but I'm very happy that I finally found something that actually works. Now if you want to give Geology a try, click on the link in the description below to take their free skincare quiz. It takes only 30 seconds and you'll get a personalized regimen designed just for you. Now the link below will also save you up to 40% off your first personalized trial set. They've got great promotions and options for any budget. Some plans start as low as 20 bucks. So give it a try and let me know what you think. Now let's get back to breaststroke. The key to swimming fast breaststroke is to focus on training with fantastic stroke length and intensity at all times in the stroke. Now this applies to butterfly as well because both breaststroke and butterfly are short axis strokes. When choosing a workout or creating your own for breaststroke, I'd recommend giving preference to shorter distances with higher repetitions and increased rest. For example, rather than swimming a 300 breaststroke continuously, break it up into 650s. Rather than swimming 650s with only 5 seconds rest, swim those same 650s with 15 to 20 seconds of rest. Give yourself the opportunity to swim a little bit faster with more power per stroke and give yourself the opportunity to rest and get the recovery that you need between each repetition. Think about swimming sets that are ultra short race pace training. The goal is to maximize your speed and output per stroke. When it comes to swimming faster breaststroke, just remember that the goal is always to perform the stroke with the optimal stroke technique at intensities that simulate a desired result. Often, this is easiest to execute when the stroke is broken up into smaller parts, hence the 50s versus the 300. So for example, swimming sets that target different parts of the stroke, like the kick or the pull, in order to focus on executing those stroke elements with more impact will be the best way to train breaststroke. When you put it all together, you'll move through the water faster and smarter than ever before. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to swim perfect breaststroke. If you haven't already checked out our other videos on how to swim butterfly, backstroke, and freestyle, those are all linked down below in the description. While you're down there, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't already checked out the My Swim Pro app, it is available for iOS and Android. We've got tons of drills, workouts for both in and out of the water. And if you're not already in the My Swim Pro global Facebook group, join that VIP group, absolutely free. Over 10,000 swimmers from over 100 countries. I hope to see you in there. Take care and happy swimming.